So, the end result. Um, very happy with how the forks have turned out. There's a lot more damping in there now. Um, and you can't, make, you can't feel any harsh kind of clicking or rubbing or anything from the bushes. Um, they're, I think they're within spec. Uh, but they, they genuinely feel like there's some damping in there now as well. Um, so that's all good. Um, so it's looking pretty cool now, I think, really. Um, I ran through a few of the mods, but obviously we've the, the forks, the tyres, the Maxis Max Daddies, uh, which are twos, I think. Yeah, 20 by two. Um, they're pretty pretty meaty. And uh, they're a nice soft compound as well. You can run quite low pressures in them. Um, what else have we got? I've got pedals to go on, actually, but Harry insisted on keeping these ones for now. Um, uh, the ODI grips, obviously, the eastern bars with the AliExpress stem. Got a few nice anodized caps with um, spaces in the cube top cap, um, just to be a bit different. Uh, protected the chain stays. Obviously, lots of different stickers and um, and sticker bomb and decoration on it. Um, where do you draw the line, though? You know, um, I could go hydraulic brakes. We got dismount on the front. Um, I could. The derailleur is an absolute monster, so I could, we could we could go like um, a short cage crutch derailleur and a narrow wide sprocket maybe. Um, but but where do you draw the line? It's it, it's a kid's bike and um, how long is he going to be on it? But I think he'll be on it for quite a while, yeah, a couple a couple of years I would say. Um, but I think it's much better now than it was when when we bought it. Um, and I can definitely recommend a few of those mods. Um, so yeah, all good. <laughs>